Hi everybody, my name is Yashita Shanidhi from Sri Lanka and today I'm going to teach you about our organs. Most people think, yeah, the ears, the eyes and the mouth, right? Of course, that's very normal, but there are a lot more organs. I'm going to show you all. But today, not in the outside. We are going to learn about in the inside. So I hope that you are going to get amazed at my video. <laughs> so now I'm just going to share the screen. So before I share the screen, I got to say that mostly I got to say that learning about organs might be a little boring for all. So I'm going to make it really fun today. I hope you all enjoy. So First, today let's learn about the body of a human. Of course, can you see this skeleton? Yeah, you, you have skin. Your skin is covering your skeleton. If you take an x-ray, you will pretty much really look very scary because <laughs> it's really funny and all. So first, I got to say that this is a bit of our body. See, can you all see the kidneys, the bladder, the stomach, the heart and the brain, the lungs? So it's, it looks super gross from the inside, but it's actually the whole system is connected to your brain. It's very, very unique actually. A scientific fact about the human body. The human body contains nearly 3,000 trillion cells. It's very unique of our bodies, in, including biology and all of that. I know that you all know that. So I got to say the most important part about our body is that our body is connected to our brain. So this is the thinking thing. Think if you are just in Snapchat doing stuff or in Facebook doing stuff. Yeah, the Facebook is kind of like a brain. It gives you information and you can share everything. It's just like our normal brain. But our normal brain can store a lot more stuff than small Facebooks and everything. Did you know that the brain, there are about 20 to zillion and trillions of cells connected to your brain. And these are not the only things that are connected actually. You see, this is how a normal body looks like. Can you all see the little cute girl and the big girl? Well, the big girl has, um, if you do this, if you do this, that's the size of a little girl's brain. But if an adult does that, it's the size of, uh, adult's brain. It's very weird. See, it kind of really looks like a brain, although it's kind of like a Facebook and all. So another example, everybody has organs, so it's very normal. You don't have to worry about anything. So, but children, some children could be born with no hands, no legs, or other body parts. So it's, it is because of stealing, lying, killing and acting like someone that you're not and acting like a bad person a lot. But there can be a lot more things, but actually not only that, that. This can also happen if you're super careless and you don't care at all. You'll be born to a poor family. You see, it all depends on our organs. If we don't have at least one organ, if we are missing at least one organ, you can't live for a very long time. You can only live till you're 20 or 25. So those are the people who are really unlucky and who are born in a very bad manner and everything. So that's why you should, I, I tell you to be a good person all the time. See, this is our brain. You, can, you might not be able to see the cells, but in our brain, in this part, there are four sections. One controls one side and the other controls this side. So that's how you can see and everything. 
And did you know that your eyesight, your brain is actually taking pictures. That's how you had your eyes. So uh, yeah, super fast your brain takes pictures of everything. Super clearly, it's super amazing that you are a human being. You should be proud of yourself and you shouldn't demand a lot because you are like living in an amazing life. If you're, st if you're poor, it's still okay. You have a lot of things inside you, although you can't see it. And you are very strong. So you have a muscle, you have a gun or whatever you have. That's not what really makes you strong. I'm not talking about the strength strong, the strength, strongness. I'm talking about the heart. The heart is really, really strong, although it pumps blood. It actually looks very gross if you look at it. Um, if you look at it with like a mirror with your skeleton in it, it really looks super gross, but you shouldn't think that. But look how beautiful you are now. Look how radiant. Look how your skin is. Look how beautiful you are. It's all because of you have behaved like a good person in this life. You had behaved like an angel in this life. You had behaved like a lot in this life, actually. So it's actually really good. It's actually really nice if you are a nice person like that and all. So most people think that meanness is the way for everything. But it's really not. I know that that's super simple and everybody knows, but that depends on your brain. And how you think, your whole body works. So if you think something bad, then your brain is connected to a bad mind or a thing. So then you just feel like hurting, crawling and killing and everything. That is just something super bad to do. And you shouldn't be someone bad like that. I'm mean, like, look at me. I'm a normal girl. I have a YouTube channel and that's it. Most people think that. Some people think that gaming is super smart and everything. So they can be super good gamers and everything and they could get more stuff by it. You may be able to get money a lot quicker than normal YouTubers, but you are not doing it with your real heart. And you are losing your brain because of it. You can't live like that. So I am happy if you understand that. It's a real importance to learn. So I'm so thankful if you all like my videos. But don't forget to subscribe and like. Bye.